The following contest is scheduled for one fall, and it is for the World Heavyweight Championship. Introducing the challenger from Battle Creek, Michigan, weighing in at 235 pounds, Rob Van Dam. Rob Van Dam has come close to becoming World Heavyweight Champion on a couple of occasions, but he never got it done. One time thanks to Ric Flair and a sledgehammer. I remember that vividly. Uh, close, but no cigar, Cole. But I have a feeling that tonight, Rob Van Dam is going to be smoking a big cigar. This may be RVD's night. And from San Antonio, Texas, he is the World Heavyweight Champion, the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels! Well, folks, it was WrestleMania 14 when we thought we'd seen Shawn Michaels for the last time, but he came back at SummerSlam, not to wrestle, but to fight. And then at Survivor Series eight days ago, he won the World Heavyweight Championship in the first ever Elimination Chamber. You know, I guess the Heartbreak Kid is really the comeback kid. I thought it was impossible, but he did it. This is Shawn Michaels' first title defense since winning the World Heavyweight Championship at Survivor Series. Yeah, this match should include Chris Jericho, and it would have if it wasn't for Scott Steiner. I thought you'd bring that up. You've become one big Chris Jericho butt kisser, I gotta tell you. What? Shawn Michaels had the will to win at Survivor Series. He had the belief that he could reach down into his soul and pull it off and beat anybody in that ring with him. And that's exactly what he did. He beat five other men. Yeah, but you have to admit, Cole, he had an advantage. He didn't have to enter that elimination chamber until very late in the match. He got to sit back and watch a lot of those guys literally beat the hell out of each other. Including Rob Van Dam, who was in that match from the get-go. Rob Van Dam is no stranger to championship goal, particularly in ECW, where he was two-time tag team champion and the organization's longest reigning television champion. I must admit, Kang, I'm shocked to hear you give credibility to anything related to ECW. Oh, it's still extremely crappy wrestling, but there are some good things that came from it, and one of them is in the ring right now. And let's not forget Rob Van Dam has quite a WWE resume as well. He's a former European champion, hardcore champion, and of course, intercontinental champion. Rolling out of harm's way. Smart strategy there. He's in a bad spot here. Whoa! Ah, he does it again. Oh my gosh! Watch it! Rob Van Dam won a triple threat match here live last week to become the number one contender for the World Heavyweight Championship. And Booker T and Chris Jericho were the other two men in that match. And let's not forget Christian and Scott Steiner interjected themselves into the match. It was pure chaos. But when the smoke cleared, it was Rob Van Dam who walked away with tonight's title opportunity. Shawn Michaels has been a controversial superstar here in WWE ever since the first day he arrived. And what about that little trick he pulled before this match even started? When he went into Rob Van Dam's locker room and slapped the taste out of his mouth. That's mind games, King. 
That's good strategy from the veteran from San Antonio, Texas. Mind games? Yes. Controversial? Absolutely. I guess there still is some of the old HBK in Shawn Michaels. Oh, this could be huge. Look at this. Could it be? What a move. Shawn Michaels switches it up. HBK can be so unpredictable. Great offense by Rob Van Dam. And here's Rob Van Dam. Rob Van Dam with the offense. Look at that, Cole. Great offense by Rob Van Dam. Oh, no. Talk about getting launched out of the ring. Look out. Whoa, whoa. Shawn Michaels has to be protective of his lower back. Two. It'll never be the same following his well-documented back surgery. And undoubtedly, Rob Van Dam must focus his attention on Michaels' lower back. There's a... Oh, touch. watch out. What's he going to do here? Bam! Big forearm off the rope from HBK. And a kip up by Shawn Michaels. And Michaels is feeling it. Shawn Michaels is feeling it. Sweet chin music time. Tuning up the band. Here it comes. Hey, and now RVD ducks the sweet chin music and hits with his own. And you can hear the fans willing him onward. Rolling out of harm's way. Smart strategy there. What a completely unbelievable move by Rob Van Dam. Well, going to the top, high risk. You can see him struggling to stand. Rob Van Dam, Whoa. five star frog splash to the back of Shawn Michaels. Can Van Dam capitalize? All he's got to do is turn HBK over, and this should be it. Here we go. Van Dam into the cover, hooks the leg. Who the heck? Hey! Triple H! What's Triple he H is here! Look out! Rolling into the title match with a pedigree to Van Dam! Yeah, but you got to know, this is not about Rob Van Dam. This is the vindictive Triple H. Going against, oh, going after Shawn Michaels. Yeah, Triple H that has been obsessed with the heartbreak kid. Well, now, wait a minute, put that down. What? Oh, this is not gonna be good. The game with that steel chair in the ring. And look at the way he's eyeing Shawn Michaels. He despises Shawn Michaels. He will not stop at anything until he ends Shawn Michaels' career. Shawn is down and out here. Oh, wait. Look at this. Michaels firing back. Big right hands to Triple H. Oh, right back to the midsection for the game. And now the game hammering away on Michaels. This is turning into a brawl here. And Michaels never giving up, King. Yes. He's got the heart. He's got the guts. He's got the soul of a champion. Shawn Michaels just will not quit. Oh, wait a minute. Look oh. out. He's right, right through the chair. Oh. When is this going to end? Oh.